Hey, it's KMA. How's your day today? And welcome to the corner. We're down in my storage facility, the hall where I will probably be keeping most of my storage and my mines. And um, we need to make this place look pretty good. And I've been working on some designs and I don't know. I was gonna work on the ceiling. The ceiling's supposed to be an arch ceiling. So what I think I'm gonna first do is take this uh, design that I have for the walls figure out a way to incorporate it around the whole thing this pillar situation is going to go to all four sides so you kind of see where i'm going i'm going to make some sort of arch thing to bring out this maybe make this tunnel bigger they're going to be longer i don't really want to be able to see the end of the tunnel when the tunnel's done um and basically what is happening is that my branch mines go to either side here we don't really care about the branch mines, but we want this particular room to look good. Probably going to be a center point, which is right, right here, right here. And um, I might stick something in the center here to break up the room. Maybe a big statue, maybe a water fountain, maybe something. I don't know. Um, I'm going to start using some things from 1.13 because I have not really done that at all. Um, there each. Oh. Reaching. I love reaching and trying to break blocks. So first thing first, I'm gonna um, work on the wall, figure out what I'm gonna do for the corners with this. But basically this is the, the grand idea. Um, and the initial thought was I was gonna have like a little area to go in there for little statues and like halfway through the corners but I don't know how that's gonna work and the only way to really figure that out is to finish the wall and then try and poke some holes in it and see if that works or whatever but this will be the area that I'm probably gonna end up going to the most because this is where most of my storage is gonna be so it's gotta look really nice you know what I mean I think over here I might make this as a um as a um the portal to come into my area making this design around the whole thing i'm not sure if i'm gonna have the stairs like this around the whole thing i don't know this is gonna i'm gonna have to do this and figure out exactly what i want then once i get the walls done i'm gonna carve out the ceiling then um work on how i want the ceiling done i don't know if that's gonna happen in this video but yeah it's my goal is to basically finish off the look of this room maybe not the centerpiece but at least the look of this room then we can um work on the way it looks coming down but i believe i did since the last time i saw you i did some massive caving and um got some uh, a lot of stuff in the wither skulls i don't know why i just say the wither skulls like that but i guess i like to say wither skulls I'll stop it. <laughs> I'm gonna get to work. As you can see from the back of this, um, I did do some work. Let's check out what the design ended up being. Uh, um, ignore that stuff, but this is the design that I had chosen. And I um, used some streams and I uh, had some time off. Nice. Um, and did this all. So now what I gotta work on is the ceiling, which is gonna be this huge dome, and weather's at 1%. Okay, weather is at 0%. I had weather at 1% and I could heal, still hear that thunder like that. That's some close thunder, or... It, what? For some reason, I can't get the thunder to stop, and it doesn't go away with weather, so I don't know if that's a bug or what. But um, I kind of like this design. If anything, it needs a little bit of help in there. But I think overall, it's pretty good. I may add some a secondary wood and a secondary um, block to break these up a little bit. But this is the basic gist. And I'm not sure if I'm going to use the blue 
Uh, or I'm going to switch this out to concrete and have a different color for each direction. But I just used the blue lapis just for reference right now. I don't think I'm going to keep the lapis, but I'm probably going to change these blocks out with a different color for each exit. And something a little bit smoother. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe... Um, I can use some prismarine or something. I, I haven't really thought about it too much. So basically out in this direction is going to be the huge storage room. And this is just going to be the main hall. I don't know what it's going to be used for or whatever. But um, it's here. <laughs> we'll figure it out. And so I'm just going to start working on the ceiling and uh, get this roof, uh, the ceiling done a little bit. Oh, I love seeing slimes in my room. I love seeing slimes in my room. Except I can get slime without a slime farm, even though there's plenty of slime farm and plenty of slime on the server. But now I don't have to go that far to get it. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Look. Balls of experience. We need that badly. I am in my normal position when it's about to reveal parts of this build. It's only halfway done, but I kind of wanted to show you what I am looking at. And, you know, we've got that. So let me go over to the side. Dude, can I jump onto this? Yeah, I'll go right here. And we'll slowly go. So we got the light color, the other colors of the Mesa making the dome I'm gonna have some lights up at this area so it can lighten up um, I'm having a crazy idea it may or may not work and there's the top of the dome uh, so there will be lights involved here so it shows up a little bit better and I haven't done the other side Believe it or not that's a little bit of work um, and I haven't changed the blue yet these are definitely going the blue is definitely going um, but here's my idea with this. This is uh, kind of crazy. Um, I was thinking of making, taking these things, these end rods, and somehow putting them at different heights, not attached to anything, all facing downwards, making like little constellations. And if it doesn't work, I'll wait till um, the lanterns come out and I'll make the, I'll just hang the lanterns. Oh, actually, lanterns need a block to stick onto to hang crap. Hmm, I guess I won't use lanterns But um, one thing I do like about this is I I set this end grade a little bit this very top end grade So it looks more 3d ish So I kind of really like that up there um, But you know, I, I, I always change projects as I go along And this one may change too Another thing I was thinking of doing was premiering these episodes um, on YouTube. So when the, the night that they come out, I will be on YouTube chat and uh, premiering them. Hopefully that's something that people want to do. And then I'll be doing that like on Monday night, 7 p.m. Eastern, which is a little late for the yogis that I know in England and stuff. But I'm sorry, my, my schedule does what my schedule does, and I can only do things when my schedule allows me to do those things, so. So I'm going to um, work on getting this side done, um, then ripping out the rest of the blocks there. I've got to go and get my pickaxe and stuff fixed up, so let's go do that. This is sad, um, even though my base is right down there, I have never actually been to the end other than for the dragon fight. So I'm going to see if uh, possibly there is a ender end down here. Oh yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you guys know this, but I changed my 
cat signs. <laughs> so I uh, have all these little cat little pictures. I think they're cute because, you know, cats. All right, yeah, see? This type of stuff uh, I did not know was even out here. I should probably not be rifling, but my guess is that there is a... Um, and then they're in down there, my guess. Just a guess. See, let's see if there's any... Oh, yeah. Look at all this. Okay, so we've killed the dragon a bunch. Excellent, eh? Alright. Um, yeah, so I think I'm going to go run down to the other side and uh, see if there is an ender ender down here. And if not, maybe that would be my project. But I'm pretty sure there's one down here because... Yeah, the server's been around for a couple of months, and uh, it's one of the first things that you kind of build because it's one of the best XP farms now, especially the uh, gold farms are a little difficult. But for all I know, this just might go to the other islands, but you know, when you start seeing water and a platform like that and the things set up like that, especially with the purple wool, you go, well, guess what? There must be an ender end down here. So guys, guess what? <clears throat> With all my illnesses and stuff, lately you are getting to see something I'm seeing for the first time on the server at the same time. Oh, the purple wool. Purple wool! Jam doggies. Um, nah. Okay, so let's get our... That needs to be mended, so let's get that up here. None of this stuff has mending on it. No, I gotta really get some mending books. Oops. I don't know why uh, they attacked me like that. They're not supposed to be able to hit me, are they? Well, who cares? So I'm going to uh, hang out here and get my pick up and going. And, um... Oops. <laughs> and start finishing this project up because this video needs to be released tomorrow so I need to finish my roof. I got my other video that's ready to be released next week done but not this one. Weird how that works sometimes. Enderman farm was good because they all are but this one is uh, I think my favorite one on here so far so let me show you this one while we're out here to finish up my pick. The only problem with it is that um, you're killing these guys. Let me show you. You're killing these guys, and they have the little spiky things, so they hurt you when you sh kill them, but it seems to work a lot better. Um, this is an amazing build. I'm not sure if it's 100% done, if there's going to be a real dome up there, if it's going to be the outline, but as you see, it's also iron farms. Good thing about this is that I can hit that on, give it water, so they all stay in one place, and I can close this behind me. And I have all the uh, rejuvenation things, but uh, let me throw this in the opposite hand. Just keep shooting these things and just make sure uh, you eat every once in a while. It's not one where I can just hold the button down and completely get them, but um, these guys give off a lot of experience. Plus, it helps the uh, creator. I don't know who uh, created this. There's a sign outside that will tell us who made this. I'll, I'll give them credit when I'm done fixing my pickaxe, which doesn't take long here. For some reason, I get more XP from this than the Enderman farm. Don't know why that is, but this one's more... Uh, it makes you use up more of your food because you are getting hurt each time you're slapping these guys. So guys, it's done. Um, I didn't show much of the actual building because I am really uh, missing the replay mod. This would have been a perfect project for a replay mod. So once uh, Forge, hopefully at some point gets um, updated to be running well with the latest versions of Minecraft, there won't be any replay mods. So I'm looking for alternatives. So if you know an, an alternative, because having that cinematic mode is, is pretty cool, especially with builds like this. And I really wish I had that ability here because then you would see the, the growth of this going as it goes. I mean, it's not the biggest thing in the world, obviously, but um, if you've known my life, I haven't had time to do anything Minecraft. I, I can squeeze like, half hour a day maybe if I'm lucky into doing Minecraft and 
with everything else in my life, um, it's really hard for me to find time to do any sort of project. So having a project that actually did take several hours instead of, you know, one session, for me at least, um, was exciting for me. And I hope that with the support of you guys and the future that is coming towards me as we speak right now, that more and more a time to do things like this that I want to do. So in the future for this area, like I say, I want to put some lights up here. Um, i got to figure out how to do that right. I have ideas. I've gone over ideas in this video for that, but um, I haven't really come up with the thing. I was actually thinking of making a little gif of just circling. Just circling. We get rid of that circle. Can we gift that? Maybe we can gift that. Maybe you can gift that for me. <laughs> but anyways, uh, this is done. Um, like I say, there's going to be an entrance that goes up somehow from here. I completely blocked it with this <laughs> because I had my way out. Now I had to uh, change the entrances around. So obviously my thoughts for upstairs are going to be a little bit different. Over here is going to be uh, where my main storage is going to be. I don't think I'm going to be doing that in the next episode. Um, but we'll figure out some stuff to do because you know what it's pretty fun playing on servers and stuff and even though I um, get myself lost and I have trouble finishing videos to give you an idea the very first video for this video was recorded in September 24th okay and it's closer to December than it is to October right now so that's the time schedules that I'm stuck on right now, but hopefully um, hopefully I can figure out something so uh, I can be a little more consistent. I'm planning on doing a Mr. Craft every other week, every other Monday, and my other main Minecraft video every other Monday also. So if you like this, uh, give it a like, tell your friends, um, I'll be streaming again, and uh, you can come hang out with me and have lots of fun. I'll make you smile. I, I promise I'll make you smile. Everybody likes to smile, right? 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 I think? Right? Okay. Well, anyways, have a great day, guys. It's KMA. Good. Bye.